guys welcome to pc tips pro this is shrija over here and in today's video we gonna see how to host a blogging website with wordpress so why blogging so blogging is a thing which you might have been listening uh, nowadays very frequently so blogging is something which you can do if you even have one skill if you have one skill literally one skill you ju- you can just start blogging right now so for this blogging what is need to be done your a question may be arise in your mind so i'm here to clarify everything and i'm here to show you how to start blogging from the very very basic level without any technical knowledge so without any delay let's get started so for blogging we need to create a website which can be done in five basic steps so first step is we need to choose a best hosting service provider so here i am choosing this hostinger and i will discuss about it in a minute so then after then you can choose your domain name and after then you can go over the installing word process and the fourth step is installing your theme and fifth step is finally editing your uh, complete website with wordpress and everything i will show you in this video so then first step i am choosing hostinger which is a fast and secure web hosting service and it is cheapest as well as best service provider for your website and domain registration and as you can see here plans start from 59 rupees per month which is very very cheap and affordable for us so here we have some web hosting plans over here we'll discuss them uh, what what are they and what are their benefits so firstly we can see over here single web hosting which uh, costs you 59 rupees per month and you can save uh, 70% which is a lot so here uh, you have this uh, you'll get one website you can host uh, one website and you get 10 gb ssd storage and 10000 visits per month and you can use one email account only and you get free ssl which costs you 855 rupees value and you cannot get this free domain uh, in this uh, single plan and you get 100 gb bandwidth managed wordpress wordpress acceleration 30 day money back guarantee which is if you after purchasing this package if you are not satisfied within 30 days you, your money will be refundable this is very very good thing about this hostinger and you can you will get two databases and the it assets and when it comes to the silver plan which is most popular uh, premium plan which is most popular and you can see over here uh, your uh, 100 websites you can host and all the extra facilities compared to this first package we can see over here which is single web hosting and this is premium web hosting and when it comes to this business web hosting you can see we, you have multiple facilities and benefits so depending on your uh, availability or your uh, requirement you can choose between uh, in among these three so preferably i say you can go with this premium one which is uh, marked as popular most popular one so you can see all features also let's see yes so here we have uh, everything is done and we will go with this premium web hosting so let's add this to the cart second some seconds will be landing yes here we are so here you can choose your uh, time span so it says uh, it cost you around uh, uh, 3.99 per month if you take for one month and if it is 12 months it will cost you 2 to 229 and if you choose it for 48 months it will be uh, ni- uh, 119 per month uh, which is a good choice for you and uh, so here you get this uh, you are eligible for your free domain 
which is a very good thing so let's search some domain name over here i'll just go with some domain name and better you go with dot com because it is a uni international uh, universal one which is very common for everyone so uh, other than rather than this uk and dot net you can go with dot com preferably so let's search for the availability of your domain and we are almost done so we see that yes our domain registration our domain is available and it it is free domain uh, we are we you just get this free domain for this premium plan and your total cost is uh, 6754 and you can now click on checkout button you can choose your payment method a upi or paytm or the net banking paypal gpay and if you have hosting a balance you can pay with that too so this is your order summary and you can choose one of this anything and you can go ahead with that you can fill all the particulars in the uh, of your account and you can proceed with this uh, plan so guys i have been logged in with my account so this is the interface which you see this home interface you will be seeing so then go to hosting and there Uh, so i have named my website as the pctipspro.com so go and click on the manage button which you can see in the right hand side so you will be redirected to this uh, web page so scroll down and you can find this auto installer click on it and then we can yes here we land into and select wordpress this is the third step uh, so let's uh, summarize till here so firstly we have chosen this hostinger and then we have uh, registered the domain and then now we are installing wordpress so this is the third step and uh, yes uh, pctipspro.com this is your uh, uh, website name this is the website name that have given so password we need to give so here enter your password and website title i give the pc tips pro and it's your website title you can give it anything then uh, go with the language english and then click on install and wait for it to be getting installed so it might take a while and it may take uh, some few minutes so let's wait so here you can see wordpress is been installed so you can see your uh, website uh, name or website link url over here so you can click on it so uh, to see the preview of your website so it is very very basic one so you don't find anything creative over here but it is a website we can make it a uh, very more uh, very much creative by adding your themes we have themes which is in the step 4 so by adding themes customizing it according to your requirement is the last two steps is all about so here uh, we can go into this uh, details or you can go to manage here you can see all the plugins which you can which you have added extra plugins and dashboard when you come to this dashboard and click on edit website you can see your uh, c panel uh, we can see your wordpress and see uh, it is what this customizing your site and when you come back to this previous page which we have seen this url which is created by wordpress installing wordpress click on this we have seen this basic thing basic version 
so we want to edit it so for editing purpose you go into details and you can see all the details of this application wordpress and admin url and this is the url that you have you you, uh, you have to uh, visit your uh, website and this is what for editing so click on this so here we are and now we gonna add themes in the appearance section you find themes uh, one and here i add new theme so for blogging i i personally recommend these two themes uh, which i have found more relevant to blogging so i'll show you both you can choose any one of it or else you can choose many themes are available you can choose any of them but this is what i have found which is uh, relevant to a personal blog so i'll show you the preview of this so so this is how it is it has 48 ratings and this is the preview of it and i will show one more theme ribosome this too looks good and you must try it So here it is ribosome. So this too looks good and I will go with ribosome for this video. I'll activate it. So once we install and we activate this, now this is added to our uh, website. So let's see our website and let's let's customize our site. So go to dashboard and click on customize your site and you will be seen with this this is the ribosome uh, interface uh, which is the theme is been applied over here and you can change this uh, names and all i will show you how to change this how to customize your entire website page so here uh, we can go with the general settings first and you see this is the site title and we can change this also dpc tips pro blog we can add anything i am just adding so you can see the change has been occurred over here and you can change the ta tagline to my first blog or my food first food blog or travel blog you can add anything which is relevant to your blog content so this will be your title and tagline and then you can go back so this you can click on this publish so that it will be permanently on your site of course you can change it afterwards but for now to update it so you can change the theme color let's try out purple purple is good but it looks uh, somehow dark so we can we can change these colors too according to your requirement and this works good so for me the first light blue thing was good so i'll just I'll, i'm happy with that and you can select header colors so which we write uh, the color of the header so i guess white is pretty good but if you want other colors you can try this out other colors too so let's click on publish i have made no changes for this let's get back to fonts so you can change the font of your uh, let uh, letters you can choose let's choose some uh, random one so this is up you can change the font you can 
try this so i i like this uh, font so i'll keep it like that and the background image you can select any image uh, we will see from media library we don't have any media library for this for some themes we will get media library too we can add our person photos you can customize your website with your photos own photos by selecting uh, files uh, from your device and you can add on to this website and then you can go back to this um, customizing and now we can see this content so you can select this sidebar where it should be like left side or right side this uh, search bar uh, the sidebar means this search bar and all here you can see recent posts recent comments archives categories meta etc so you can choose this and i'm good with having right sidebar so i don't change it and about post here we have some options you can choose them according to your requirement and then we go with this footer footer text so here you can see this footer text copyright and footer text center so here we can change like you can give your email id for any contacts or anything or uh, you can see you can create this um, email or else you can give some random random stuff which comes to your mind like which which hits you like uh, it is to be needed you can add some photo text over here i can give some email just a random mail because so i'll provide some mail over here so it is like that you can give anything over here and then uh, we can see this additional css and all so this is all about customizing your page you can change it in whatever way it is and now it comes to changing this text portion have to change so click on this edit button so you can see here yes so here it is our recent post so you can change the title uh, you can change the title and the number of posts to show like you may post many uh, posts but you want some limited ones to be displayed so you can add and uh, i give the number over here and i'll give uh, uh, title to be some let's change it and see so it is post so we can change it uh, the name from recent post to post or updates you can give uh, you can change it to be updates so it's all up to you and you can change this um, you can change you can change the links to actually so you can change this recent comments and so here we go and you can even do this you can even change this uh, search bar title to some other thing like start exploring or i i guess i could give exploring explore so you can give that name too you can even remove or add new sections for this you can i if i want to remove this meta section i could remove it and if i want to add one another widget i can add an audio or a, from gallery or anything from this add widget button so you can check out this and you can by using this all features you can customize your website and you can make it too beautiful and creative you can even change the theme from ribosome also again if you are not happy with it you can change it you can search for themes you can change it and i could see Uh, one just random theme over here i would like to see the preview and you can even do this this is i'm doing this because if to say you that 
we can even do this like we can even change the themes now like in the customization part too we can change our themes we can install them and we can preview them and we can activate them to our website so this is how all we can create a website and customize it according to our needs so once again if you want to have a quick summary i will show you this hosting is our first step that choosing a best uh, hosting service provider so here we go so hosting is a better best service provider in fact i personally recommend you all to start with hosting if you are really really trying to get your good uh, blogging site with the best hosting uh, services it is fast and very secure way of web hosting and its plans are affordable for common people and its uh, benefits are like wow so you need to you must try this and i personally recommend you to go with this uh, hosting and also uh, let's go over the steps so first step is choose the hosting uh, the best uh, doma- uh, the best domain uh, registration and web hosting service and then we go with the domain registration in this hosting uh, like by choosing one of the plan among these three so preferably premium web hosting and then we install wordpress and then we go with installing a, a relevant theme and then we finish it up by customizing your website with proper themes and text and images everything so at last you get a final product with much creative and much beautiful attractive website for you so from this video i hope you all learned a lot and i hope you like this video thank you